to ever do it. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Thanks for having me on. No, thank you for coming in, man. It's been so good to see you. Long time coming. All of this time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. man. <laughs> uh, if any of you guys are new to this channel um, or just joined us in the uh, amazing cavalcade of links that I've just found across the internet, uh, we have two hours of amazing new music from you guys and we have a bunch of exclusives from Max Jones, aka Predo Liddy, who has been very kind enough to bring in some tunes that, uh, yeah. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a good one. Oh my days. I've, I've, we, we've been drinking so much coffee prior to the oh stream starting. <laughs> I'm oh sorry. Somebody Don't help. Say, ah, ah, <laughs> tunes! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. Um, so, yes. Where's the. Bit more headphones. That I'm late. So, yeah, it, it's, it's been a bit of a strange one because. Um, this is like the, the we, this, like we were normally when pre-COVID times having guests in what probably about every other week or things like that, and it, it's been a while. It, it's been a hot minute since we've had anyone in on this show, man. So I, I'm I'm so glad you're able to come in and um, yeah, hang out with us and, and do some stuff. I'm honoured, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'm honoured, honestly. Love it. Been watching the show for time. It was a big help to me kind of yeah. last year as well oh, with all amazing. the feedback and stuff. So yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, the so, thing that you're doing for sure. <laughs> big up. Um, yeah, and like it's been really nice to like uh, hear the music that you've been doing over what that like, the last like year, couple of years. That, um, uh, yeah, year and a bit. Yeah. yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's, it's been really cool to, to uh, hear your, your progression and, and stuff. So um, yeah, we're we're gonna wait for a few more people to roll on in as we uh, get started into the show tonight. Um, yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be an absolute mad one. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, uh, we have got loads loads of people have been submitting stuff through the week. Uh, tonight, we have got... 
tunes from the likes of um, Ill Truth, uh, Ill K, Pilo Lily, of course. We've got Manny Dexterous, Quake, uh, Cavitz. We've got uh, Antares, uh, Curbs, one of your friends has sent in the tune as well. Yeah, Nate. Big up, Nate. Nice. Uh, we've also got stuff from... Uh, Reborn Fisk has sent in a couple of tunes. We've got uh, Marvin Gaye, Nat Ford, uh, John Connor, uh, the bad techno man has come in once again. Uh, we've got Doodly Box Bush, uh, and what's this? Um, uh, Nopara, Nopara Bo. Uh, we're going to have a, a little cheeky chat um, about halfway through the show and just find out just generally what you've been up to, uh, all that kind of stuff. And we've got a bunch cool. of exclusive tunes to share with you guys as well. So. That's going to be awesome. Uh, we've got a bunch of people flooding in on the chat as well already, which is awesome. Uh, let me just get everything resized and stuff because I'm a bit, a bit out of sorts all over the place, but we're getting there. <laughs> um, let's have a look. What else have we got? And yeah, a bunch of stuff to talk about for uh, different streamers you want to be following, the Unlucky Dip, and then there's a whole host more of amazing submissions coming your way. It's going to be a good one. So uh, yeah. Get settled on in and um, yeah, sit back, relax, and turn up the tunes. It's gonna be a good one, guys. Uh, let's have a quick chat, quick up one on the chat. Uh, Mr. Fcom is already in the place saying, Greetings, people. TNT here. How you doing, man? It's good to see you. And uh, Patrick Canal is saying, uh, Big up, man, like Polo Lily. Uh, he's liked your 1020 show. Oh, yeah, it's the, my monthly radio show. Yes. Uh, yeah. Nice. Thanks, man. Yeah. Awesome. Glad to hear peop some people are listening at least. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's always awesome to um, like catch up with other people's streams. Like that. One of the things I found very, more difficult going through lockdown is it, there's just so many streams happening like all the time. It's, uh, it's such yeah. a nightmare to try and catch all of them. Right. <laughs> For real, yeah. Gave but, up a um, while ago. <laughs> yeah, but quality streamer over here, not not like me. Like, I'm just like holding things. I'll say no, you're a few leagues day. above me, my man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I hope you just got coming. Uh, Jasper Stevens, hey, yes, mate, how you doing? Welcome on in. Uh, yeah, we have got loads of amazing stuff for you guys tonight. And if any of you guys have been uh, acutely aware, in the corner right here, uh, we have our new Boombastic Sounds avatar. Uh, Big Bastic Sounds guy. We don't actually have a name for him yet, so if anyone wants to come up with suggestions for this little dude uh, down here, uh, if anyone subscribes or uh, gives bits or all that kind of stuff like during the show, then I'm um, just going to do a little, little dance like this. Like uh, like he says, move smoothly. Uh, like this. There we go. There he goes. <laughs> there he goes. Look at him go. Look at him go. A man possessed. Um, yeah. <laughs> So he does all sorts of like boogie and stuff, and if we feed him a little bit of energy, if you want to feed your boom boxer, he gets really aggressive with the uh, with the head bobbing, and eventually he does a little strut, and he's like, yeah, yeah, feed the tunes, uh, 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 uh. How about Boom Bastion? <laughs> that is a good one, actually. Yeah. yeah I quite like that. <laughs> like Sebastian, but Boom Bastion. No, he's fun. Uh, right, yeah, so let's not waste any more time because we, did, we didn't get Polo Lily in all the way into the studio just to look at my avatar on, on my stream. <laughs> so, I've come miles. Yeah, exactly. Literally, <laughs> like two miles. Well, there you go. But we, we could probably amp up a little bit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but that was a funny thing as well, as I didn't realize that you're actually in Bristol. I'm in the same postcode like, as you, man. Yeah. 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 That, that's crazy. Yeah. But in any case, it, it's still, it's, it's quite an effort to get to this house. Yeah. It, just getting out of the house in general at the moment is, is I mean, a bit of an effort. traffic, like, come yeah. on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a Shadow Blade as well. How you doing, mate? It's good to see you. Uh, yeah, let's not waste any more time. Let's get straight into the playlist tonight. There's loads and loads of stuff. Okay, so first up, uh, for my top selection for this week, we're going to start off with uh, Ill Truth. This is out on Skank and Bass. Uh, the this tune is called Fruits. Futile. Uh, this is the coherent remix. Let's get into it. So I hope you're ready, uh, Max. We've got a bunch of yeah, like I've made sure we had a good selection of um, what's the word? Uh, like drum and bass and drum and bass. Kind of. It's it's so nuts to have like somebody else in the studio we can actually like talk with. It's just like oh, like, I, I'm not just talking to myself all the time. This is a bit strange. <laughs> Rather novel. So is this like your picks? Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Let's get into it. I'm just going to share the show. Yeah, man, do your thing.
twangy rhythm. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it really kind of like throws you about the place, doesn't it? Yeah, right. <laughs> Kevs for the follow. Welcome on in. Good to see you. Big ups, Kevs. I don't know if I'm hearing you through my headphones. Are you not? Not really. Quite quiet. Or is that just because you're plugged in over there? Uh, yeah, it might be. Like, you throw your headphone. You know wow, if I, turn that, if I turn that up, yeah. the music's getting louder there now. So. Is that better? Uh, Check, check. Hello? Oh, yeah, that's okay, yeah. Yeah? All right, yeah, yeah, that's good. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah, there's like a real like atmosphere to this tune. It's, it's really nuts. Mm, yeah. Nice breakdown, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, want, I want to listen to this like cap down right in front of the sound system, just going absolutely crazy. <laughs> Soon. Jacob to say yes boys we good yeah yeah man we're having a great time we've literally just got the show started so yeah you are you are in prime position to get your face fully loaded with loads of amazing new music coming right up here on the show tonight and um in about an hour's time we're gonna be having a proper chat with max uh, aka polo lily and uh get into a bunch of exclusive tunes that he's brought into the show so i can't wait to hear those oh my god <laughs> it's gonna be so good uh we've also got uh Blizzo UK, yes mate, how you doing? Saying uh, late sleeper vibes on this, yeah you know that. And uh, Exploded Brawn, uh, it's an easy now, hope you guys are doing well. Uh, yeah mate, we're having a great time. The show has literally just started and it's already vibes, you know, <laughs> it's, it's all good. Yeah, huge chain that. Yeah, there's just like a real like crazy kind of, um, what's the words? Is that, is, that, is that kind of like thuddering bass? Mm, but the production's so nice, you just got all the crispy kind of ness going on over the mm. top. And it's just like proper ear candy. Yeah, man. All right, let's get into uh, this next one. So I actually um, found out about this tune because I was going through some of your old tunes and mm. then I realized that um, one of the tunes you're on is on this album. Um, yeah. What is it? Uh, from through the, through Omega. Through Size, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And the, the whole album is really good. If you want to go and support uh, Pelo Lily and a bunch of other artists on there, that make Footwork Jungle. This is a really good album to pick up. This is a sick label or um, in general, man. Yeah, yeah. Really, really good stuff. Um, did a lot of final releases as well uh, out of um, Berlin. Oh, hang on. We got some Nintendo 69. Nintendo 69. Nintendo. Oh, what are you doing to me? Oh, Nintendo. What's happening? Oh, Nintendo. Or we could watch whatever, you know, whatever you're into. <laughs> what was that? Uh, so somebody donated 69 bits and um, I completely forgot that. What's a bit? Uh, it's like um, it's, it's Twitch it's currency, crazy. basically. Right. Yeah, it's just that. Um, and I, yeah, I, I'm really sorry about that because I completely realised that the uh, the notifications were like directly over your head when that was going. That's up. cool, man. Like, so yeah, I did apologise for that. But uh, <laughs> 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 oh, my God. thank you, thank you to uh, then Cre then Maya created for the 69 bits, and um, yeah, we just had a bit of 69 action all on uh, Pelo Lily's face. <laughs> 69's all over my face today. Oh yeah, baby. That, that's how we roll. Like we've, we've already got what, like uh, 15 minutes into the show? We're, we're already getting like um, hot and steamy <laughs> up in there. <laughs> oh my days. Right, uh, yeah, I'm gonna make sure that, um, hang on, let's get some background music on the go. Let, let's make sure that the, the uh, Steam notifications are like right in the middle. There we go. Sweet. Let's size that up a bit better. I think that's a bit <laughs> Oh my days. This is, this is one of the things that like, I've been on my been on my own in the studio for so long. Like, I've just had everything like customized to, to just like it's it's the little things. It's the little things you forget about that catch you off guard. <laughs> but we should be all good. <laughs> oh my days! Just sixty nine in all on your own. Yeah. You? <laughs> oh my god. Quite the mental image. Oh these these yeah it's, it's it's been a long lockdown. What, what can I say, mate? <laughs> <laughs> um, let me catch up on chat real quick. 
Uh, okay, so, um... Oh yeah, Jasper Stevens saying that, hey, out of them I created. Um, loads of lovely, amazing people in the chat right now. Um, let's see, who else we've got on here? Uh, <laughs> then my creator's like, yes, so worth it. Uh, and also then my creator's saying that uh, she loves the new animation as well. And... <laughs> So that's where the 69 belongs, to be honest. On my uh, face. Yeah, on your face. <laughs> <laughs> Flippin' act. Oh, my days. Bro, well, yeah, it, it's, it's not that kind of stream, guys. Like, so, <laughs> wait, if you've come if you come to Boombatic Sound expecting pools and hot tubs, well, that was a one-off, all right? <laughs> but we're not getting our tits out. It's not happening. TOS. I mean, uh, maybe, maybe if the donation is, is big enough, maybe I'll get my tits out, or like a singular tit. Right. We'll tit see, reveal. See how it goes, yeah. Tit reveal at 10,000 <laughs> bits. Is it? <laughs> bits so, for something tits. like that, yeah, I, I don't tits. know. <laughs> Everyone in the chat, just, uh, yeah. Um, g give us some bitties for titties. If, if you want to see even myself, or if, if Prello wants to get involved with the party as well, I don't know. I, I don't want to sell mm, like, mm. Prello Lily's tits, to be honest with you. I'm that worth a lot more than that, baby. <laughs> Well, there you go. So while we uh, while we figure out how how low we can go on the stream, let's get into the next stream. <laughs> <laughs> so I feel like we're getting massively sidetracked already. Uh, okay. It's this it's this LK one. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh this is a banger. Yeah, music. <laughs> this one's huge. Oh my right. So this is uh, LK with a tune called uh, Persecution. Mm. Mm. One of my favourites off the comp. This one. Is it? Yeah. Nice. Let's get into it. Oh, you're allowed to eat to interact. How you doing, mate? Good to see you, says Ayo. Oh, my days. What's about to stream? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Mr. Fcom say hashtag beats for your trees. Or, teats. Or, or teats. Oh, teats. <laughs> I'm just going to show up and drink my coffee because I'm just getting <laughs> us in loads of trouble right now. <laughs> really nice build up on this. Spaceship. We totally are. <laughs> On the Boom Basic Sounds expedition to find new beats. To boldly go where no wobs have been before. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is my shit. <laughs> this is good stuff. I like that, that is. I'm back to now, just play space. It's all about that Amen piece. Yeah. Like just sticking a little bit of Amen in there. Yeah. We're not going full. Love that. It's such a head bobber, isn't it? <laughs> So raw, that is insane. Ah, mm. oh, yes, that's a reborn Fisk in the place. How you doing, mate? Good to see you. Now, if this tune is making you pull a bass face, 
We do exclamation point face to pillar base face. And we are keeping total tally. I think we've had like... We had like 226 calls since we started using this feature. <laughs> and if you have a tune you want to get into the playlist, it's really simple as well. You can just do um, exclamation point SR with a space and then the name of the tune you want to put in or the URL for SoundCloud and we'll put it into the playlist. An industrial sound but it's like it's really clean as well like it's not too distorted yeah man it's huge, it's huge. really really big track oh my gosh oh yeah shadow blade saying this slap is so hard it really does mate oh my days and we've only just got into the first couple of tunes tonight then we've got so much amazing stuff coming up oh my god <laughs> <laughs> all right let's go straight into the next one and not waste any more time uh so uh this is one of my favorite tunes that um max has actually made um and it had a little, little admission it's, it's not actually one of yours isn't it no well um <laughs> the, is quite, quite the strange. thing about it is i made yeah. it over a year ago now and mm. i think i just think my ability as a producer is a bit better so it sounded a bit dated to my ears but yeah, yeah. i i mean i still stand by it as a kind of competition yeah, yeah. i think like i i i, I think well out of all the tunes that you've sent us, like that, I'm, I'm pretty much like into them in uh, a lot of different ways. But this one particularly, I think it's just the atmosphere of it and kind of like the laid back style is like, it's really nice. Um, nice. Yeah, it it's has that, that old kind of like uh, like early '90s like jungle vibe. Yeah. With that with that footwork kind of like style, it's like beautifully blended together. And, like the atmosphere in it is it's really nice. I'm gonna stop blabbering on about it and let you guys enjoy it. This is uh, <laughs> Five Feet Under by Polo Lini. Let's go. Let's do it. Five feet under, we should probably go into the depths of the water in it. Oh yeah, definitely. Here we go. <laughs> Here we are, under. submit this tune to the show uh, like a year ago now. Like, yeah, what? No. Where's yeah. the time gone? Yeah, right. <laughs> Five feet Drum work in this is fucking awesome. Thank you. I really, really love this. Yeah, the guy, um, Robin, the label owner, um, asked me to send him some jobs, but I didn't have any. So um, I just whipped this up in a couple of days and sent it over to him. And like, really? yeah, he just, he just, I liked it. So. Fresh out of a couple like, of sweet. days. Fair yeah. play, mate. Yeah, Fair it play. Long Uh, out to uh, Mr. Ecom as well, saying that uh, yeah, he's really looking forward to finding out what Polo thinks of his submission because he's got some of the hardest spells coming up later on in the oh, show. Oh, really? Yeah. Nice, can't wait. Out to uh, Nate Known as well for the big ups. How you oh, doing, Nate? Man? Big ups, Nate. <laughs> Where's Mike? That's what I know. Nate, call Mike and tell him to tune in. Hey, What's man. happening? Where's he at? 
Oh my days, right. Yes, good, good stuff. Uh, oh my gosh, right. Um, mm -mm. So, uh, coming up next, uh, this is one I wanted to pull out the hat as well because I think this was probably... Second it was, I think. Was it the first one? I think it was the second one because uh, the first one Mike sent it, sent it in on my behalf. Oh, uh, okay, the, yeah. Um, that was the even Gwen Stefani tune. Oh, uh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this was the first one I sent in on my own. <laughs> Fair. Yeah. So this, this was like the first submission um, I remember getting like, probably from uh, Polo Lee himself. And um, so this is a, a really strange hybrid. I, wanna, I think we played this like a little bit. It's been it's been a hot minute since we've actually played it on the show. But uh, I think when I first heard this, I had this on repeat for, for so long because it's, it's just one of those that uh, it, it kind of like pickles your brain. Cause it, so it's got like the sample from Arnie L in there, which is like yeah. hard trance. Yeah. And then you've got like kind of like the little bits of um, vocals from Spice Girls. Yeah. And then into the drop, it goes into like the jungle, and your brain's just like, um, well, I think even at that time, like I hadn't really heard that much footwear jungle, mm. so it completely threw me for a loop of just like, what? What am I even listening to at the moment? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, but I love it. <laughs> stupid music. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but, but in a good way. Yeah, well, we're, we're all about pioneering <laughs> stupid music because that, that's sometimes that is the best kind of like tracks is where you can just uh, like take a joke and run with it, you know? Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. Um, I, the, I, the, I, ju I just wanted to bootleg the kind of cheesiest tune I could think of that I thought was possible to bootleg. So this yeah. is what I ended up doing. Big up, man. Well, yeah, it totally works. And um, for anyone else that hasn't heard it yet, let's go and do it. Um, so this is uh, Tell Me What You Want, Spice Girls, the wannabe remix. Let's get into it. Yes, I had to stitch it up proper as well, saying, hey, 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 yes, Spice Girls. <laughs> Big up the Spice Girls every time. Shout out to Jerry, Posh, Baby, yeah. Scary, <laughs> the other one. Ooh, be great. <laughs> oh, man. I'm... Here we go. Stage, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unreal, like it's <laughs> like the, the use of like the vocal in this tune with everything else is, is so good. And uh, yeah, like what, what kind of spawned the whole like using polos in the artwork of um, um, your tunes? Well, the name came first actually. So um, m me and my mate were chatting on text, and um, he t tried to type something. I think it was like lol lol lol, like laughing a lot. Yeah. And um, it got autocorrected to Polo Lily. And I thought it was a sick DJ name, so I was like, "That's what, <laughs> that's what I'm going to be called." And then, um, and then I just because I know from trying to market myself in the past, it's important to have a kind of like strong visual branding. Yeah, yeah. So I was like, "I'm just going to do it as simple as possible and just jack another brands, stick Fair. polos over everything." Yeah, man. Yeah, it, it so, works. Yeah. Yeah, it looks really good. <laughs> yeah, it seems to be doing okay. <laughs> nice, man. 
I am big up to them, my created for uh, doing all the amazing shout outs in the chat right now. Thank you so much. I, I, yeah, I'm a, a little bit hot and flustered tonight, so I do apologize if I'm missing shout outs and stuff. But um, yeah, there's so many amazing people in the chat tonight. And of course, we have the legend that is Polo Lee right in the studio. It's the very studio. Oh my gosh. Here I am. It, it doesn't feel real, honestly, at this point. <laughs> it's, it's been so long since we've had someone in here, man. <laughs> this feels so good. All right, let's get back into the studio because we've got loads and loads of stuff. But yeah, if you haven't already, go and give Polo Lily a follow on SoundCloud. I will post up his links in just a second. If you want to find more of his stuff, go and get it. Yeah, and, um, loads of free downloads. Pretty much everything yeah. on, on my SoundCloud's free. So, it's so generous, mate. You've you got, like. you got all the free downloads, you've got all the webs, you've got everything. <laughs> um, all right, so uh, let's get into some exclusives. What'd you say? Are you ready for some exclusives? Uh, yeah, ready as I'll ever be. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's get embraced. Um, first up, we have uh, Base of Militia Records. Nice. Uh, with a tune by Mandy Dextrous. This is her tune, uh, Manania. I think that's how you say that. Manana. Oh, yeah, Manana. There you go. See, this is what this is why we need you in the studio more often. <laughs> you can just help me like pronounce all of the, uh, the names I, I, my, my simple brain can't handle. <laughs> oh, right, right. Let's get into this. Some speed bass madness. Big up to every single one of you watching live right now in the chat. This is an absolutely sick stream. And uh, yeah, let's fucking go. good way of producing tunes that don't sound like anything else, you know? Like this whole speed bass movement that she's been coming up with is, is so unique. <laughs> Absolutely huge. This is definitely a bit of me. All those yeah. rave sounds, like fast four fours, all over it. Yeah, man. It's, it, I, honestly, like this whole like speed bass movement that um, Mandy Dexter's has been pioneering over what, the last two, three years has yeah. been. It's been really, really strong. Yeah. It's like a real nice hybrid of different sounds. And and I think uh, it seems like it's been a big influence on people like I guess Samurai Breaks and stuff as well. Yeah. Now kind of producing in this four four kind of turbo, but like really ravey and fun poppy kind of way yeah man yeah All yeah yeah fucking good huge oh big up to uh, James uh, aka the base militia bad man who um, sent into the 
the uh, ex exclusive for that. He's also been kind enough to share with us uh, this tune from Quake. This is a tune called Personas. Let's get into it. Out to Reborn Fisk who's saying that Mandy Dextrous, it's incredible. Yeah, she she's an absolute uh, like beast of a producer. So fair play to Mandy Dextrous. If you, if you aren't already, go and give her a follow. Right up next, we've got yes, uh, Quake on Personas. There's a whole album from Quake, so go and check it out if you like the stuff. Good evening. Yeah, I think it's just your mic. I can't hear, I can't hear you talking. Oh, really? Oh, uh, yeah, that might be the thing. Um, right, let, let me try and do some last minute. Be right back. <laughs> Yeah, this microphone. Yeah. 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 So, <laughs> right, let me um, quickly move this over and then, yeah, I'm going to try and, but basically, it, it's been a while since we've been using this desk for more than one microphone and uh, discovered today that, uh, yeah, like, for whatever reason, only one of the channels on this stupidly large mixer that doesn't want to work. So, um, yeah, 
that that's the thing. <laughs> uh, what we're going to do in the meantime is going to go over to uh, an exclusive while I try and fiddle about with the uh, setup a little bit more, so it's not not quite so in in your face kind of thing. Um, wait, where are we? Uh, okay. But I mean, you know, it, it wouldn't be a boomatic sound show if we weren't holding this uh, whole show together with duct tape and like, literally <laughs> just trying to like roll with the punches, right? That's the kind of like chaos you come to love from this show, isn't it? For real, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I get down with it. All right. Um... Are you there? So, uh, if you wanna, do you wanna read out any comments we've just seen? We got JK the Juggler, yo! Nice, yeah, I mean, uh, that was a pretty dope tune. Uh, this is dope from Mr. Fcom. Um, I agree. Yeah, it was a bit of a crazy, what was that? That was some DMB. Quake. Uh, yeah. Quake is a madman or woman. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I mean, you've got to be a little bit to be kind of producing at that level, I'm sure. Yeah, for real. Lots of just sticking around in your bedroom, not getting much sunlight, eating cornflakes, <laughs> uh, curtains drawn. That's um, every producer's dream, right? Yeah. <laughs> All day, every day, no social life. Um, and yeah, that's that's the chat. All right, lovely. Um, right. Uh, yeah, so yeah, Draco, yeah, we're... we're <laughs> We're keeping the show going as much as we can. It's uh, it's, it's a little bit chaotic at the moment, <laughs> but um, yes, the the um, avatar is working pretty well. That's the important thing. Yes, that is the. the Bastian is. No matter what else is working right now. <laughs> Having an absolute ball over there. But um, for for whatever reason, it doesn't seem to want to like energy up when people are chatting. We need some more chat. Thing. So I have to like I have to constantly keep pumping them up like I pump my speakers, you know. But it's okay. Uh, other than that, yeah, I'm pretty sure we got some XP when somebody did de some bits earlier. So uh, yeah, that, that's all cool. But um, yeah, he's having to have a he's having a great time. Uh, so while I um, try and finesse the last part of the uh, speakers over here, um, speakers and and the microphones, we're gonna get into the next tune, which is a Boomastic Sounds exclusive uh, from. Uh, this is from Flux with a tune called Kravitz. Let's get into it. on the 6th of August. And you've got the exclusive first play right here at Boomatic Sound. It's, yeah, it's a really nice piece of drum and bass. Ah, oh, yes, that's Austin Payne who just joined us. How you doing, mate? It's good to see you. Let's 
Let's go and see the Mario Kart one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Wobbly bass is, is something else, right? <laughs> All right, let's have a look. Uh, we've got really um, Mr. F. Gorman who just pulled a bass bass, he's been loving that tune. Uh, Reborn Fisk as well, saying that, yeah, he's live and that. Uh, I've got Exploded Prawn saying, nice. Um, so Reborn Fisk is working and listening to some tunes right now. Uh, totally the best way to go through it. Yeah, 100% with you on that one, mate. And, um, what's this? Uh, yeah, so Austin Payne saying, it's been a while since he's caught the show. Damn work getting in the way, damn work. <laughs> Uh, it's exciting to hear some new tunes. Um, and you need to send over some new D and B stuff he's producing. Yeah, dude, yeah, do it. Totally do it. Woo. Oh my gosh. Yeah, crazy, crazy stuff. Um, right, yeah, what did you watch your reckon of that, uh, Max? That was a ride. Loved it, man. Yeah. Uh, that, that, the production on that bass, the way it's um, all the mids were super sort of fizzy and crispy but the lows were deep down yeah really, yeah man really nice pod on that uh so if anyone wants to grow and grab it you can add that to your wish list on uh juno download like right now uh yeah highly recommend that you do it's uh yeah it's gonna be a good one gonna be a good one all right um let's move swiftly on because like we're, <laughs> we're nearly an hour into the show really? haven't even got uh, through the exclusive section yet which is which is crazy oh my, oh my days yeah it's um now now that um grumpy Linear is not on the show this the the, the the scale of it is kind of ballooned out of all proportion <laughs> like <laughs> i don't i don't know how much time you've dedicated to, um, to tonight yeah we, we, we can call it whatever basically whenever's good for you but <laughs> yeah. um yeah i, I just thought <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's up. Um, right. Uh, let's get into this one, which was sent in by Anne Sarah. This tune is called uh, Out of the Eons, which is, uh, yes, yeah, this is a great tune. Yeah, sick producer. Let's get into it. And uh, while well, this tune is building up, I'll just catch up with chat a little bit. So Jacobs is saying uh, that wobble bass in that last tune was silly, man. Yeah, it was unreal, dude. Uh, absolutely unreal. Um, and let's have a look on here. Uh, bob, 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 bob. I think Draco's trying to feed some energy. Energy. To, uh, let me um, post that in and see if that works. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, that's what it is. Maybe it needs to be a... Um, I'll give him some mod status or something. Uh, one second, Draco. <laughs> Love how um, Boom Bastion is just like going nuts to this beatless intro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's into Absolutely it. Absolutely loving it. But this atmosphere is just like, yeah, I'm, yeah. I can get down to this any day. something I'm not. <laughs> <laughs>
what a drop. Nice, man. That's great. It's not to... Annoyingly good. <laughs> wants to set up the fire, set up the car alarm, oh god. <laughs> I, are you ready to get on some car alarm action? Are you down for that? Oh, I know what this is, yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's... Day, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> on a loop, 10 hours. Yeah, like Antares is just like a habit of just creating more ish, more ish brains. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Oh god, and we just had like Firewolf redeem the, the air horn hype as well. Oh my gosh, it's, it's all kicking off in the chat right now. <laughs> all right, but we need to catch up with some redeems, so let's, let's cut one off there. But uh, yeah, big up to Antares for creating um, yet another crazy, crazy beat. Yeah, man. Uh, right, let's get into. Let's have a look. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh yeah. Uh, right, let's catch up on these real quick because um, otherwise we're gonna this hot this whole show is gonna get away from us honestly at this point. <laughs> um, let's get down over here. Right, so where's where's the air horn at? Oh man, this it's been a while since I've had some of these dreams. Why is that not? Oh, great. Oh. There we go. All right, so this is out to uh, Friar Wolf in the chat right now. <laughs> it, it takes like a certain, it takes like a certain out of like energy out of me to do this stuff. <laughs> But here we go. Fuck. All right. It, it's so, it's 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 one thing doing this on your own. It's another thing doing it when there's when there's a producer that you really respect like right <laughs> next to you as well. Fuck it. Okay. Out to out to uh, fuck out to fry a wall for the hype. <laughs> Fire, wolf, fire, wolf, fire, wolf, fire, wolf. I just realized I've, I've been taking down the wrong thing on there as well, which is, this is not so good. Let's try it again, shall we? Right. When I say fryer, you say wolf. Fryer, wolf, fire, wolf. When I say fryer, you say wolf. Fryer, wolf. Fryer, wolf. Fryer, wolf. <laughs> fryer, wolf. 
I haven't watched a show for a while, and that's news to me. But this is, I'm all making this up on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> all right, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, right. And um, Mr. Fcon went to South Carolina. I'm fine. Is that that meme? Like, uh, is that the tune with the yeah, fire alarm in it? Yeah, yeah. So, um, fuck. Okay. Let's get back over here. Because you know, everyone loves derating this show. Yeah, man. I, I like this tune, though. I think it's a banger. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the first time you played it, you're like. Ugh. I was like, no. Yeah, well, it's yeah, it's, it's become it's become a Boom Basket Sound staple. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm here for it. Right. Uh, that's the thing. Actually, we need this on this one, don't we? Come over here. So, uh, as you as you are the um, the guest of the show, um, let's see what what sound effects do you want to go for? Do you want to go for a boing? Uh, do you want to go for a slaps? Cartoon crash? Some slaps? Yeah, uh, that's the Okay. Yeah. What's Anne fucking Ville? <laughs> we, we can load that in, that's okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, which would be on here. And then uh, last one. Uh, do you want to go for a gong? We've got some tiny up screws. Um, tire screech. Scratch. Scratch. Down the bottom there, second one up. Uh, yeah, record scratch, okay. Yeah. We can do that. All right, so. This goes out to Mr. Fcom. Um, hope you're having a good night, mate. Um, actually, what is he? What is he doing down there? Fcom, you're supposed to be watching the stream, mate. That, oh, for <laughs> he's only got on set off, hasn't he? Here we go. Right, Fcom, please. Just, I've only just got this car back from the shop. Don't fuck up anymore, right, mate? Just, yeah, you can, you can slap it about a bit. Just don't go too crazy, all right? You stop driving my car! That's hard. Fucking Jesus Christ. Mate, the amount of times I've had this car messed up, you would not believe. Can you stop? Mr. Fcom, please, mate. Just... I'm not gonna let it get to me. I'm not. Have you quite. Have you quite finished with my car, mate? Have you, you quite done? Great. I, I, can you see all the dents in my car, mate? Like, what? Fuck. It's a denty boy now. Oh my gosh. It's, it's never gonna ride the same again. I don't know how I'm gonna get by, honestly. Oh. And now he's put a record player in my car. What are you doing at, mate? Will you stop messing around with 12 inches in there? What? Oh. oh my gosh, dude. I swear, every time I get my car back, it's just a kept amount of time before something. What's that? I, I, I don't what are you know. Like, Fcom, are, are you right there, mate? Oh, God. I don't think I'm ever going to get the stains out of the upholstery, honestly, at this point. <laughs> um, oh god, and I've completely forgotten where I've... It's been so long since I've done this, I've even got the... Uh, the right... Oh, there we go, that's what we're looking for. <laughs> Alright. Oh, no, no, yes, yes. Alright, Echo, have you, have you quite finished fucking about my... Mate, please, no. Dude, I need this car. Where are you going? Echo! <laughs> That was wild. I've never seen you do Man, that. Man, what a right. <laughs> every week, mate. Every single week my car gets jacked. Really? Every single week? What is that about? You invest in a better alarm with a less dope beat. I guess, yeah. <laughs> And uh, on that bombshell, um, F Mr. Fcom, can you please be careful with my car and um, not fuck it up? Because like, the, the state you left it in last time, it was... Uh, it had to go through the wash like three times before we could get all the stains out of the out of the um out the seat. So uh, yeah, and um, after we've lowered the tone about as far as we can possibly lower, it, let's bring it right back up with this amazing tune sent in by Nate Known. This is tune Space Ballet. This is a work in progress. Let's get into it. Ooh. Yes, Nate. This is 
my sample use. Oh. oh my gosh. Thank you so much for the subscription, Draco. Big the fuck up, mate. To Mike Braithwaite, he's just throws in the chat. Yes, what mate. time do you call this, Mike? <laughs> what time? See, he, he knows how long I am. He's just like, yeah, he's pretty well getting get <laughs> yeah. these sides for the show by this point. Give it. <laughs> when is that tune get released? When is it? Give it. I, I'm totally down for more of that. Uh, anytime. I think the one thing I'd say is in the kind of build up and breakdown, there was quite a lot of different elements going on, which is not a bad thing. But I think maybe they could have done with a little bit more separation, maybe a bit of EQing, and yeah, maybe a little bit more going on in the high end. But uh, like uh, the drops were uh, excellent. Mm. I thought, yeah. Yeah, yeah, really, really good stuff there, man. Um, yeah, I, 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 like, I just instantly want to hear the tune like from start to finish again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> really, really good stuff there. Uh, thank you so much, Nate, for sending that in. Uh, yeah, really super impressed with that. And uh, please do send us more tunes uh, whenever you feel like it. Uh, yeah, massive, massive thumbs up from me. And everyone in the chat has been going mental as well. Yeah. Uh, Mike Braithwaite has been going... Um, I've just... I've tried Making some... up for lost time. Yeah. <laughs> I was uh, picking a rewind. Uh, I would love to do a rewind, mate, but um, we are. Okay. Oh, right. Okay. 
as I am filling for time already, let's 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 take it back. It's funny, we can't do too much because we've already got an hour deep into the show. But this was an epic tune, so we're going to play it a little bit again. As a patch now for the, the rewind request. Uh, Jacob is saying, Jesus! Mike Braithwaite is saying, pew, pew, pew! Along with all the bass faces. <laughs> Shadow Blade also saying, uh, yeah, just all the emotes in the chat right now. Uh, Mr. Fcom saying that this hits the sweet spot. And uh, Jasper Stevens has got exclamation point head spin. So he's obviously having a good time. And Mr. Fcom is saying that it's uh, beer o'clock over here. Yeah, you know that, mate. Bad man, what the fuck? <laughs> also, your um, your um, like progression skills and like with the way you move the brakes and the bass along and the melodies is like uh, day, day and night compared to the kind of stuff you were sending me a few months ago. So big ups, dude. Yeah, yeah, a hundred percent. Like, wow. <laughs> I'm so glad that um, you managed to convince Nate to send stuff into the show. Yes, yeah, it's fucking yeah. sick. Um, let's get into the last exclusive of the night, which is by Curbs. This is a tune called nice. Hole Punch. I've been chatting to Curbs on uh, Insta. And oh, I yeah? told him to send something in, so yeah. Oh, nice. Here He's one of go. your mates as well. Uh, I don't know him personally, but we've just been chatting over Insta. All right, nice. Let's get into it. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, we got Mike Braithwaite saying, uh, show us some ankle. Wait, what? Um, I, 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 250 bits, Mike. Yeah. Then I'll do an ankle reveal. <laughs> so, you know, we're... Um, yeah, uh, when you're on Twitch, you have to pay for feet and ankles, I'm afraid. Yeah. Like, that's how it goes on the internet. We don't we don't give away that shit for free. What, what do you take us for? This is an ankle hub. Exactly. This isn't boom basic ankles. It's boom basic sounds, motherfuckers. <laughs> Alright, let's go.
hard. Sounds so unique. Yeah, it's got a kind of. It's got a lot in common with like old dubstep, but also it's a little bit ghetto house, a little bit. Um, yeah, it's almost like deep house as well. A little bit Baltimore. Yeah. yeah whoa, whoa. There, there we go. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, big oh, yeah. ass, dude. Uh, Curbs, that was sick, man. Uh, I'd say like. Uh, need some work in terms of just EQing out some of the lows on maybe the um, elements that are not bass. Locate everything to 120 is um, is the general rule. And um, the composition though, like banging. Yeah, I love the way that it built up in a kind of a atmospheric, uh, like mid 2000s dubstep way and then just drops into that kind of like booty. booty yeah, man. Yeah. Big yeah, guy. yeah. This is like that kind of like. Uh, like the rolling growl kind yeah. of thing on it is is really satisfying. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love that kind of uh, I don't know that bass kind of honk. Yeah, man. That it has. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's get straight into the next one, which is okay. So. Um, I I am aware. So um, yeah, we're already like about an hour and a quarter <laughs> into the show. Um, so we've got how many more tunes on it before we get to the news? Uh, let's have a quick look. Let's see if I can shuffle some stuff about. Um, I mean, like, it, is there like a, a hard limit of where you want tonight to finish? Uh, not really. I mean, I'd like to be in bed before 11. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. So if we go to what, like uh, 10? Yeah, is man. that okay? Yeah. Yeah? yeah? All right, sweet. So, uh, in that case, yeah, we will be able to go to the next one, which was sent in by Reborn Fisk. This is his uh, submission uh, by uh, Low Fatic. Uh, it's a tune called Cold Ways. Let's get into it. Mike Braithwaite saying the last one was naughty, by the way. Oh, yeah. Fwa. <laughs> agreed. Fully agreed. Big ups, curves. We've got Patrick O'Dow as well saying, like, being battered ankles. Lol, 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 lol. <laughs> Onlyfans.com/slash. Only ankles. <laughs> Only ankles. <laughs> Speaking of ankles, we've got an undead ankle like foot in the uh, in the artwork right now. So if anyone is is desperate for a bit of footwork, a bit of uh, foot artwork, then uh, we've got you covered. Don't worry. This, uh, this album last week and yeah the whole thing is, is awesome yeah oh
Street Woman Fist has always got a really good taste in music. So, uh, oh, so is this um, something that somebody sent in, but it's not, they've not made it, though? Oh, uh, yeah, they oh, okay. suggested it, yeah. So I was going to ask if they're in the chat. Yeah. yeah. Like, Reborn Fist is in the chat, um, but yeah, he, he has a really good taste in music. Nice. Reborn Fist as well saying bounce. Austin Payne saying this is dope. Uh, Thunder Blade saying donk. And uh, Mike Braithwaite saying there it is. That's what I'm talking about. If you look, you are liking the sound of this. Do not go anywhere. Keep it right here at Boombastic Sounds, where in just a few more tunes time, we will be having a full chat with Polo Lily right beside me. And we've also going to get into some exclusive new tunes that he's brought with him. So yeah, it's going to be absolutely sick. Do not go anywhere. Keep it right here at Boombastic Sounds. There's such a good groove to it. Yeah. Well, what do you reckon as uh, as a producer of like Footwear Jungle? What what do you reckon that kind of stuff? Well, this kind of stuff. Um, yeah. I mean, there was jungle elements to that, but yeah, more footwear key than stuff I I make, I suppose. And yeah, um, I love it. Uh, yeah. I mean, more of the Chicago sounds in there, but also it's got that kind of UK centered. I saw that they're from Portugal, so maybe like more this side of the border. Yeah, man. Sounds, which is nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um. Well, there we go. Um, there we go. Okay. Um, right, let's have a look. Uh, where are we in the chat? Um, Mr. Fcom saying, can you pay my submission within the next 40 minutes, please? Uh, yeah, I will try to, mate. Yeah, we've just had uh, loads of people um, submit stuff for, for, this, for this week's show. So, yeah, just bear with me and we will get around to it. Um, let's see. So Reborn Fisk is saying this is a new label born. Uh, get ready, people. Nice. Um, yeah, Mr. Fcom as well saying uh, very well produced. Mm. Everyone was loving that last uh, couple of tracks. Really, really good uh, reactions in the comments. So that's awesome to see. Um, God, did, I, did I miss a thing? I think earlier. Oh no, yeah, it's from the subscription. Okay, cool. I was really worried that I missed a. Um, a bit of shout out or something, but it's all gravy. Right, let's get into the next one. Let me just have a quick shuffle on here. Uh, right, if we move these down a touch. Okay. Um, yeah, that. Okay. Um, Okay. <clears throat> All right, so uh, let's get into. Oh, I just closed the tab I was about to play. <laughs> there we go. All right, so next up is uh, Warp Core. This is a tune, uh, Humanoid. Uh, this is actually uh, the original tune was a hard trance, like classic for ages. And then recently it's been remixed. Uh, so yeah, check it out. This is the 2021 remix by Ian Underground. 
And that is after SoundCloud has stopped messing me about. Uh, any second now. You're listening to a preview of Warpcore Humanoid, the remix EP on Impulsive Records. Let's get to the main drop because it is a five minute tune. <laughs> Don't forget, exclamation point bass, if you want to pull a bass bass. Uh, use the exclamation point SR if you want to request a tune. And if you have any questions for Polo Lily in the chat, uh, we will be doing a little casual chat slash interview type thing very shortly. So if you have any questions for him, um, let me know in the chat and make sure you at me and I will get it in the show. Listening to a preview of Warpcore, Humanoid, the remix EP on Impulsive Records. on um, hard trance, Max. Uh, I like it. I don't know anything about it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Fair What can you say? It's a good remix for sure. Like I, for me personally, I, I kind of like burnt out on hard trance like quite a few years ago, but I, I'm still digging this for sure. So yeah, big up to the one like in underground for uh, yeah, a really nice rework of this classic. It's got a really nice, like, bouncy, uh, like, free party bass to it. And, um... Yeah, it all sounds sick, like... Yeah, yeah. I don't know, you know like I said, I don't know about the genre, but <laughs> it all sounds very pleasing. Yeah, man. So, yeah, big up Ian Underground for that. Uh, yeah, please do tell us some more. That's on Impulsive Records. All right. Um, speaking of uh, big, hard sounds, uh, next up is the one, like, John Connor with this tune called Acid Drop. Coming in once again with some hard techno. Let's get into it. And then immediately after this tune, we're gonna get into the news, which is the fact that Polo Lady is in the place. Keep it right here, Happy Basic Sounds. Big up to all of you guys that are watching the live tonight. We've got loads of you in, it's absolutely amazing. Big up to everyone bringing the vibes right now. Oh my god, listen to that acid line, man. What the fuck? That is so good. Thank you. 
that kick is insane. Like, it just makes me like instantly feel like I am just right in front of the sound system, just getting my head imploded by uh, some big speakers. Next time. Yeah, man, for sure. John Connor always comes up with the goods. And uh, yeah, that tune is called Acid Drop. That is out on Bubble Jam. Uh, go and check that out. That is, when was that? Uh, yeah, that's out right now. So go and get it if you like it. Oh my gosh. Right. Uh, let's get back into some of this. All right, um, mm, 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 that's how it looks. Where are we? Where are we? With everything. Do, do, do. Okay. Um, lovely. So let me just boot up the new sound effect. Uh, so how are you finding your um, your guest slot on, on the show tonight so far, man? Loving it, man. Yeah. Chilled out vibes, tunes. <laughs> Good times. What's not to like? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's really cool to see the other side of the curtain as well. Yeah. Well, is it, is it, <laughs> is it a, a manic? Is it a, more tabs than you could ever possibly have thought they would yeah, be uh, yeah. switching with? <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to lie. It's setting me off a bit. But yeah, no, it's, I mean, like, it's very impressive, man. But it's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> the way you're juggling everything. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, uh, yeah, I've had to... Um, this is, yeah, it's like, I, I really ideally just need a soundboard where I can just, can just yeah, wire yeah, everything yeah. into. I've just a, got hard, so a hardware pads thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I've just got so used to doing it on um, the four track uh, record box yeah. for, for so long. It's kind of become like second nature to me at this point. He says as he is constantly um, traffic around trying to find the soundtrack for the news theme and then failing miserably. Uh, there it is. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. Let's get. Well, Jesus. There we go. Uh, yes, and on that uh, amazingly unsmooth transition, <laughs> let's get into the news! That's what I'm talking about! Oh uh, yeah! That is what I am talking about! Oh my gosh. Where have I put the... <laughs> I got too many tabs open. <laughs> You need oh, another, another screen to have to uh, Yeah, yeah. Just, I, I need like a, a, a separate screen for each individual tab. Yeah. That, would, that would do me really well right about now, I reckon. I think we're just about that. Uh, there we go. It's like yeah, that it's that one. Yeah. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> there we go. That's what I was looking for. All right. So, uh, yeah, we are officially at the halfway point now. Um, and, yeah, it's... It feels really weird, but amazing to have another person in the studio again after all this time, honestly. Um, uh, obviously, I've, I've kind of like mainly been focusing on Big Basket Sounds like once a week just because it was kind of like a self-sustaining beast. But um, like, how, how has it been uh, as an artist like going through like this is the whole like, kind of like lockdown uh, like process while, while still creating music? I mean. Yeah. Uh, how how has like the last like year and change been for you? So my my day job is actually uh, event DJing as well. Mm. So the first thing that happened when 
like we got locked down was that I lost all my work for, Shit. for I mean the whole yeah. pandemic so um, that was a bummer yeah but, yeah because uh, <laughs> um, I was just getting into a really good flow of like um, making time to produce in the studio yeah in the week oh hey man let me just get the mic a little bit better for you it's up that's better. There you yeah. go. Yeah. Um, and then, um, kind of, uh, yeah, producing in the week and then going off to do gigs at the weekends, getting in a real good groove of it, felt good, producing like three tracks a month. Yeah. And then it was just all work went. So it was a double edged sword, really, because um, I lost all my work, but it meant that I just had unlimited free time. So yeah. I just put everything into music then. Um, so, yeah, ended up just spending the whole of last year almost 12 hours a day in the studio fair yeah so it meant that i could put out way more tunes than i ever could have otherwise which was a blessing Amazing. um obviously i had to live on basically nothing but that, that yeah. it, worked, it worked it was fine like in the end yeah, yeah man. i'm back at work now so it's all so good came out awesome the other i'm really happy to hear that and thanks man you have been like one of the most like prolific uh, submitters to the show. Um, like, f- I, can't, like I think I was doing what I was doing at least one a week, like for yeah, while, right? <laughs> yeah. your machine. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's always uh, like a, a really good um, like level of, of quality as well. Uh, so it's, it's been um, like it's been so cool to say, as I say, like having that initial starting point of. No, knowing you as the guy that remixed uh, Spice Girls with Arnie yeah. L <laughs> yeah. to having uh, a really crazy amount of awesome Footwork Jungle tunes out there. Um, it's been really interesting like following your sound as you've been putting like more and more music out there. Yeah. Um, I think you've even been featured on, uh, wasn't it like a, a, a Boiler Room DJ uh, featured on your channel at one point Boiler as well? Boiler Room, um, I've been on Radio 1 since then as well. Oh, um, amazing. Yeah. Um, uh, Rinse, well, rinse. Yeah, I've been. I've done a set on rinse now, um, and yeah, like pretty much every radio station I can think of. Uh, so it's been yeah, like absolutely Smashing crazy. I've never like obviously completely unexpected, but <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> like really cool. Sick. Well, um, so- it's it's just cool that anybody wants to play my music, let alone Sherelle on Radio One. Yeah, that's I mean, fucking crazy, man. I could, yeah, it's mind blowing, really. <laughs> Well, it, it's, t- it's totally earned. I mean, um, like uh, for, for anyone that's watching right now that is a uh, producer or wanting to, uh, like, may, that might be like struggling to get their music out there um, to like a, a wider what, what would you say is like the best sort of approach to uh, trying to promote your music, uh, other than being on the Boombastic Sound Show, of course, which yeah. is the best place to find your music. Honestly, this, <laughs> this is really unique because I spent a lot of time on like Reddit threads. Uh, there's lots of different Reddits where you can submit music, but it's always on a specific day you have to do it, and it's in a, a, a thread. Yeah. So I was posting, and, and it's like feedback for feedback, so you post your tune in there, and then you have to give loads of other people feedback, and then hopefully people give you feedback in return, but it's a bit hit and miss. So I was doing that for a while, and then I was in kind of Facebook groups, but again, they're, they're trying to because everyone just spams their tunes into these things yeah um so lots of the groups are trying to like come up trying to come back on that so they're they're again like posting weekly threads and they get lost and nobody looks at them so then i started submitting to here and actually then i started seeing people react to my tunes and it gave me this confidence boost uh where i was like oh people like my music yeah so that gave me the drive that i needed to actually start putting stuff out there and then as soon as i started putting stuff out there um I was doing bootlegs, which was no accident. Uh, the reason I did the Spice Girls bootleg and the Even Gwen bootleg to begin with is because I noticed from previous projects that bootlegs do way better because people, A, love bootlegs because their yeah. audience, when they're put de- in, putting them in DJ sets, really relate to them because they've heard the source material before. Yeah, man. But also people are just searching for like, um, you know, people might just search for Spice Girls just to find that. Yeah, yeah. So it works well for the algorithm. Oh yeah, well. there's a whole like massive like niche market just just purely for like random mashups of things. You know? Exactly. So, <laughs> so I think that yeah, doing edits to begin with really big shout. Um, and then yeah, just um, kind of talking with labels and stuff. Like the other thing I was doing was every time I put out a DJ set because I was I'm a DJ primarily, is that I would tag all or or message personally all the people that i was putting in my dj sets just saying hey man really like your tune um or woman um i'm gonna put this um 
I, I put it in a mix of mine. Um, wonder if you can. I, I think you might like my tunes as well. Ah, that's a really good shout. Yeah, man. Um, and yeah, it just. And then in the end, people were kind of going, "Oh yeah, um, I like your tunes as well." And so, let's work together, or let's. Yeah. Oh, I've got a label that I can put one of these out on. And, yeah. Nice, man. Yeah. Nice. So, um, so yeah, that's kind of the way it took off for me. Sick. That, that's that's so good, and it, it just goes to show that. Um, it's all about having those, uh, like, this, like developing those connections, like like one to one, rather than just kind of uh, spamming your links out to like group chats or um, something like. That. It's about making sure you're actually building those connections with people personally. Yeah. And it, it, uh, as someone that does that for, for my own things as well, <laughs> like I, I can totally understand that. Uh, yeah, there, there's a certain amount of. Um, bashing your head against a kind of like a proverbial internet brick wall but uh yeah you just uh, as i'm sure you know it's just that consistency right it's when you start making those connections things just take off because yeah. one person will, will play your music to another person and another person and another person and then you'll get invited into exclusive groups where everyone's sharing tunes um and people are just um boosting each other up and yeah it's, it's those connections that are really important yeah, and, and that's what the pandemic's been really good for because people aren't going out into clubs and trying to talk because i like yeah oh, i make music blah, 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 like above the sound system <laughs> it's all been in text so it's actually been really good oh there's always the best interactions yeah <laughs> check me out yeah yeah, so, yeah. No, oh, it's not the way <laughs> so, yeah. amazing well um let's have a look if uh if you guys in the chat have any questions at all um yeah please do. our grandmaster only just come in the place how you doing mate it's good to see you um let's see if we've got uh See, and Fry Wolf is, is here for this interview as well. Um, nice. He's uh, like following through and circling back on um, what you put out there. But yeah, so so much love for that, man. Um, uh, let's have a look. Okay, so um, uh, you mentioned earlier that you are uh, you do like a, a radio stream. Yeah. Uh, do you want to talk about, a little bit more about that? So we can oh yeah, so I do a monthly up. residency on 1020 Radio, uh, 1020.live. It's fourth Wednesday of every month um, and at five till seven. Mm. And I always get a guest on. And the guests are from another project that I run called Bring Your Own Tracks, which is an open deck night. Oh, so um, I did that before the pandemic anyway. So I invite people that have played at that to come on. Yeah. Um, and otherwise I just play a load of really heavy breaks and nice. footwork and jungle and yeah yeah um yeah i'm I, I really enjoy doing it um just lets me kind of get all my faves out there i play lots of dubs on there like anything that i've made new i'll, so, I'll play on the radio show and so, yeah it's, it's good fun um but doing a few other guest slots on different radio stations but 1020 is the one i do every month nice man yeah I know if anyone is watching right now and you're wondering like where where can I find more Polo Lily? I have just posted there in the chat. Is. There's every single possible conceivable place you could possibly want to find more Polo Lily. Uh, please do go over to his band camp and um, check him some some uh, some monies for stuff that he's done. Uh, there's as he was saying earlier, there's a bunch of free downloads on his SoundCloud as well. Uh, so even if you um, are a little bit short change at the moment because I know that everyone is is kind of like in different financial situations because of COVID. Uh, the, even like the best way you can support someone is just by liking their stuff, commenting that you like it, sharing it, reposting it, all that kind of good stuff. So please to give Poe Lily uh, a little big, um, a little big, <laughs> a big, a little big uh, social boost. Yeah, there you go. Um, and uh, yeah, I've, I've been more than happy to uh, like share your music with our audience uh, since we like first discovered you because uh, yeah, I've really well, I enjoyed appreciate it. That, man. Appreciate that. <laughs> no problem at all, man. Um, so yeah. Uh, Let's, let's let some of your music do the talking because I know we've been talking quite a bit at the moment. Sure. Um, so one of the exclusive tunes you brought in was... Ah, oh, yes, the secret one. Yes. This one's never been... I think I played it in one mix so far, but yeah, <gasps> it's, um, it's pretty much exclusive, I'd say. So the only other person that's heard you heard this before is you, essentially. Uh, and a few mates, thing. my mum. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> 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 so there we go. So, um, yeah, guys, buckle up because we are going to be playing... Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Right. Uh, yeah, let's get into this. This is an exclusive Apollo Lily won't let you go. And um yeah, is there any last things you want to say before this before we play it? Uh no. No? Alright, no. sweet. Let's go let's straight it. into it. <laughs> it's got a long intro. Yeah. Um so I don't know if you want to skip it to halfway through or whether just let it That's play. Right. Or okay, cool. Yeah, we, we can let it play out. Long and atmospheric. Yeah. We, we can build it all up. Uh, as I said before, if anyone else has some questions in the chat, um, they want to throw away, then uh, just let us know. 
Otherwise, uh, make sure you press exclamation point BASE to pull a bass face when this tune goes off. Because you know it's going to go off. You know it's going to go off. <laughs> I'll add to Fry Wolf as well, who has just followed Polo Lily. So you've got a new follower. Thank you. Big up to Um And we've got a bike break break with uh, a very obscure question, which we'll get into after this. <laughs> oh, I understand it. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah, that's the, that's the this tune play. Frustrating things through lockdown is like hearing scenes like this, but I just want to hear that from the start of the show right now. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Zatu, uh, Zoo, Cad, 44 for the follow. Welcome on in.
Wait, yeah, this is so, so lush. I mean, when it comes to uh, tunes like this, like, where, where do you even start? Is there, like, a... Like a... Well, this one I started with the chords at the beginning, because mm. I was feeling, like, I don't know, write, I write a lot of my tunes these days based on, like, feelings I'm having, so uh, the chords I just wrote as, like, a way to kind of express that, and then I wrote everything else around them. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man. So, so nice. It's also good to start with a vocal sample, because, yeah. um, so I, yeah, just have a big pack of acapellas so I just stick into my like push it's like a uh, like a interface uh, mm. work service and then I just cut them up and see see what sounds nice and then you build a beat around them stuff like that I mean, where, 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 where do you source like a, these kind of like, these vocals and things? Or is that like a, a, a very secret? There's a, I don't want to give away all my secrets. Oh, but enough, there's, yeah. a, there's a big there's a big folder knocking about on Reddit. I think just uh, like oh. eight, eight gigabytes of acapellas kind of thing. Yeah. It's oh, called, fair it's play, man. You'd ever want in there. Yeah, that's fair. So, yeah, I don't want to give away all your, your secret sources and shit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but um, Boom Bastic sounds exclusive. There you go. <laughs> Some hot tips. Yeah. Hot, hot secret tips. <laughs> Uh, well, we've got into that one. Uh, okay. All right, so... Um, where is this playing? Come on. Oh, it's just very quiet, that's all. All right, so we had a little question while that tune was playing from Mike Braithwaite. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> where is it? Hit me with it. Uh, so Mike Braithwaite is asking, what's your favourite piece of cutlery? Is it a knife, a fork, or a spoon? Well, I'll tell you what it's not. What's that? A spoon. Really? Yeah, because I'm not five, so I'm not going to eat all my meals with a spoon. Michael understand what I'm talking about. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. All right. I mean, like, for, for me... <laughs> what, <laughs> what about you? Shots fired at the knives and forks. Apparently, like, knives and forks can get fucked. No, no, no. <laughs> Spoons can get fucked, bro. All right. <laughs> yeah, knives and forks are good. But then, Unless but, you're eating cereal. But you couldn't have a soup. knife or a fork. So if you had to choose, would it? Would you go between... If you, I'd just I eat with one. my hands. I'd just eat with my hands. If I couldn't have yeah. a knife or a fork. No, I mean, like, you. so you can either have a knife, a fork, or a spoon. Oh, yeah. Like which one of those oh, three would you choose? Yeah, you have one. Oh, yeah, one fork. Yeah, fork. Yeah. Yeah, because you can use it for hunting as well. That is true. Forks are very good. Yeah, in I a world there's where like... there's no uh, when there's no knives or spoons, I imagine everyone's hunting for their food because mm. I don't know why. Why? Why the shortage? There's got to be some kind of catastrophic. Yeah, it, it's a very era. strange uh, post-apocalyptic yeah. scenario that Mike Braithwaite has thrown us yeah, in, yeah. in the studio. <laughs> Come on, man. But um, I mean, like personally. It, the, the real secret answer of this is a spork. Oh, okay. If, if yeah. there's a situation where you can combine breaks. the fork and a spoon, then then you're, you're sorted. That's but, true. Um, That's true. Yeah. In this scenario where there's only a, a life or death situation, I. Oh. If you're eating a sausage, let me just ask you this: If you're eating yeah. a sausage, um, how? Uh, what combination of two um, pieces of cutlery are you going to use for that? Um, the end of a spoon. What? <laughs> Kidding. Oh my god! <laughs> I just You're kidding. See, Good. Yeah, I it's a see. funny joke, Mike. It's I, I just joke. wanted to see the uh, the expression on your face. No. <laughs> As someone that hates spoons so so immensely. Uh, but yeah, no, yeah, fork is probably the best one out of that. To be fair. Yeah. N knives are throwaway. Knives are always the thing left in your cutlery drawer that no one uses. Because you, you can always get by with either a fork or a spoon. More I don't often know about than that. Not. What about if you're eating rice and you need to like push, push the rice onto your fork? I mean. Yeah, at that point, I, I, I would probably just hold up the bowl to my face oh, and just let it slide in. You're a savage. Yeah. <laughs> <Got> you. <laughs> we don't use these handles just to try it straight into my face. <laughs> so there you go. Cool. Um, That's the real secret. Fire Wolf's got one with the radio. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So how did you land a radio gig? How, how did you come about that? How did that come about? So um, I decided I wanted to, you know, get a radio residency because I think it's a really good thing for like exposure and stuff. I just emailed all the local stations, so um, I, the ones that I targeted were Nudes and 1020, which are the two main underground ones in yeah. Bristol. Um, I just emailed them with a pitch. I actually recorded a sample show. All right, nice. Sent that along with email, and then yeah, um, I got a call back from 1020, so just did a trial run, and then they liked me, so now I'm on every month. Sick. Yeah, so it's well, it's well worth just um, sending them an email, getting a good solid. Um, a concept behind your show first so you know exactly okay. what you want to do and yeah 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 tell them tell them about it and yeah hopefully and with the um with the, the preview show like would you make that like a 20 minute kind of like little segment or would you do yeah. like a whole show kind of thing probably not a whole hour because they're not going to want to listen to that so yeah, yeah 20 minutes is probably about right there you go yeah sweet <laughs> and do do some chat on the mic don't just send them a mix yeah yeah sweet uh okay so um mm -mm, what's this 
look at uh, Austin Payne telling me to keep the acapella pack anonymous. Oh, yeah. yeah I mean, <laughs> Secrets. <laughs> Don't tell yeah. them about the acapella pack. Don't yeah, tell them about it. It's very secret. Yeah. Um... Firewall saying spoons the cretin's choice, bitch. Yes, Firewall. <laughs> Big ups. Um, a spoon um, can be used for cutting, scooping, and stuff, so it's the superior implement. No. <laughs> Disagree. Oh, Zafer is in the place as well. How you doing, mate? It's just um, a worse version of each uh, a fork and a knife. It, uh, the spoon is like, it's the all rounder, sure. Yeah. It's like when you choose Mario on Mario Kart. It's like it's got a bit of everything, but it's not fast. It's not. It doesn't handle well. It's so this this will be an interesting question. That, uh, bouncing strictly off of that, like who's your go-to Mario Kart character? Yoshi. Man, yes. Yeah. High five right now. <laughs> Man knows. See, like everyone knows, Yoshi <laughs> is the is the dude. Fucking right. It's the best. Yeah, he, he really is. And anyone that says any different can go and get fucked. Yeah. <laughs> right. Um. Where do we get to? Uh, Mr. Fcom was asking, Pelley, what do you think about ambient new age music? I love a bit of ambient. Um, I grew up on a lot of ambient. Uh, Selects Ambient Works Volume 2 by FX Twin, one of my faves. Um, so yeah, all, all here for it. Yeah, man. Uh, I don't find a lot of time to listen to it at the moment, but that's probably because I'm quite busy. Yeah. I think it's like a downtime kind of. Yeah, yeah. Kind of genre, isn't it? For sure. Um, we've got Zofa, I'm um, saying Spork, a spoon or fork alone. Is that what we were talking about earlier? Spork. Yeah. Uh, sp is Spork, is a Spork better than a spoon or a fork alone? Um, no. Simple answer. Uh, yes. I, I, I was going to agree with you that one. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know, that's do, a thinker, do, do, do. that's a thinker. See, Maybe. We've got everything on the... I'll fight yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. But, all right. Come well, at me, bro. <laughs> But for, so everyone else in the chat, like who, like what is your go-to Mario Kart character? Let, let, let's let it be known in the chat right now. Yeah. Um, and if it isn't Yoshi, then um, but it's just wrong. But that, that's fine. You're allowed to have wrong opinions on this show. Banned. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we just banned everyone for the chat. <laughs> um, chopsticks. Yeah, chopsticks. Yeah. Yeah. Good shout. Good shout. I, I can't get down with chopsticks. I'm I love the idea of chopsticks. I it just I. My brain, for whatever reason, just has a real um, trouble getting along with them, honestly. I love a bit of chopsticks. Yeah. I, I like, well, I like them when I can, the thing about me, like, I can just like pierce it with the, with the chopstick. Okay, well. it. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I'm, I'm a savage. Another savage so, movement, yeah. man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. And um, on, uh, t speaking of savages, let's get into your next savage tune, which is uh, Holding oh, yeah, Up. Okay. Holding on. Holding on, sorry, I should say, yeah. Yeah, so this one I'm not as sure about, which is why I want to play it now. Um, I think it's a banger, but I think maybe it's just a bit random. Yeah. But we'll see. Yeah, fair. Oh, for fuck's sake, right. I knew Mike was going to come in with this song like this. Here we this. go, what's Mike saying? Toad is... No, yeah, okay, I can't Toad's even... actually my second choice. <laughs> right. Right, Mike, you're banned. Yeah. <laughs> Out. Still banned, still banned. Get the fuck out of the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Coming here with that Toad talk, bro, you're... You're walking on thin ice right now, I can tell you that much. Go and have a think about what you've done. Yeah. <laughs> While we listen to this tune, just think about how, the, how many mistakes you just made in the chat. And um, yeah, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, right. Tunes. Tunes to tunes. Here we go.
I think like it maybe if it has like another little thing to keep you like hooked through into the second part that'll be sweet but like yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's still pretty strong ones I kind of because it's got the Pac-Man scoop sample in it so I might do oh, yeah. might do as a free download of it eventually but yeah I just um, I don't know I know there's a concept in there yeah I'm just trying to like make it coherent yeah man yeah it's good stuff dude thanks dude uh, that's Grandmaster Ong in the place how you doing dude um, yeah, let me give you a shout real quick shout out Grandmaster Ong if you haven't heard of Grandmaster Ong go and give him a follow he's a legendary juggler and all around amazing human being uh, right let's get into your last tune for uh, that you brought us for this yes. little section which is um, L-M-S-Y-D Let Me See You Dance oh I was wondering what that was because <laughs> that's the vocal oh sweet yeah alright let's get into it So Fro Wolf was loving that last tune, but you're saying yeah. the uh, the vocals maybe a bit too dominant. Yeah, 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 um, I feel you on that. But he likes all the details of the track as well. I uh, really love it for sure. Um, Thanks, man. My is asking like, "Where's Toad?" Like, he's in the bin, mate. Where he should be. <laughs> And uh, yeah, Mike Brave was also saying this is a grade A bang. Cheers, Mike. Yeah. Now let me see you dance. I wanna feel the music. I need the rhythm. Now let me see you dance. I love the way you use it. I feel so complete. Now let me see you dance.
my what is that face though? <laughs> Break, 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 say now. This is a Polo Lily tune. Yeah, really nice vibe for this one. back a little bit because oh, I yeah. need to hear that again right now. <laughs> yeah. Everyone in the chat right now, some strong appreciation to the one like Polo Lily. Absolutely sick tunes by oh my gosh. Spoiling this mate. is giving that all the guns in the chat right now. Uh, Zeus Cad 44 is giving us all the love hearts and all the fire. Our uh, Firewolf is saying that bass line is so horny. <laughs> and Shadow Blade has just pulled a bass face to that as well. So, uh, And Patrick Canal is giving that all the fire and love hearts. So yeah, so much appreciation for that tune, man. Oh my gosh. Yeah, like that is <laughs> Let me see you does. Yeah, let me see you please release that as soon as humanly possible, please. <laughs> yeah, it's coming, it's coming, don't worry. You'll see it. Sweet, soon. man. Alright. Um where are we? Uh, come on. Play? Yes. There we go. Alright. Um let's have a quick check on here. I think yes, so. Uh, if anyone has just come in to the chat or missed the little post that I put on earlier, uh, if you haven't already, then please, for the love of God, go over and give every single one of these social media things a follow, give it a like, go and check out everything on his things and give us money, give us some shares, all that kind of good stuff. He's an absolutely fucking awesome human being who makes really sick music. Thanks. So, um... Yeah, um, no problem, mate. Like, thank you for coming in and um, get, showing us some of these uh, exclusive tunes as well. Yeah, like no worries, man. It, it's, it's so much fun to um, like follow like the, the production that you're putting out. 
the fact that you're able to just keep coming out with tunes um, that are like really hitting on these um, like different bits of nostalgia, but also coming up with your own style and your uh, yeah, just, yeah. I have so much appreciation for you as a producer, man. I really, really love that um, that you've uh, continued to uh, support uh, this show by sending in stuff to us and. Um, yeah, everyone in the chat has been loving it as well. So. Really appreciate what you're doing here, man. It's great, honestly. Well, thank you, man. Just a loving. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, so, um, yeah, I think we're all about done for uh, the news. Um, is there any last little, like, um, uh, things you want to promote? Or is there, oh, like, yeah. any, like, live events? Now things are opening back up again. Is there yeah. any places that people can catch you at? Yeah, so I'm doing cozies with a label called Works um, on the 20th. Um, headline in my first headline gig which is exciting for me so that's August uh, August the 20th okay yeah yeah and then I'm in London um, at a party I'm going to pull up the lineup for that actually because it's crazy yeah yeah lineup. do it man um, at a venue called Venue MOT and that's on the 28th um, and the lineup for that is if I just let my yeah man slow phone do its thing that's okay <laughs> do what um, you gotta do it's, um, yeah, Tim Reaper, Samurai Breaks, Sean Cartier, Angel D. Light, me, Oskins, and Mixtress. So it's a proper meaty lineup. Um, Sick. Really looking forward to that one. I think that there's been 50 more tickets just released, but they're going to sell out pretty soon. So if yeah. you want to go to that, head over to Das Booty Facebook. Yeah, and that's yeah, D-A-S Booty. Yeah, B-O-O-T-Y. Yeah. Yeah, and um, Lush. check out on there. Nice man, awesome. Great. Well, uh, yeah, if it's cool with you, we'll we've got like, what time are we on right now? Uh, yeah, so we've got like another fifty minutes of music to subject you to you if you're getting down for that, yeah, down including for the unlucky dip if you're game oh. for playing that. <laughs> yeah, man, <laughs> I'm here for that. All right, sweet. Um, so yeah, let's get back into uh, the playlist. Uh, but before we do, I'm just gonna give my man John Connor a big shout out as well because hey, we just had a new follow. Is that from Christy? Is that Kushi in the chat, is it? Hey, Kushi23, how are you doing, mate? Good to see you. Uh, yeah, you have just joined us at the, the tail end of the interview, I'm afraid. But if you want to watch this video back as a VOD, then you'll be able to see all the juicy details. We've literally just played through uh, three tunes back to back um, from Polo Lily. And uh, yeah, they were fucking awesome. Um, so yeah, make sure you, you go back and watch the video on demand. Uh, as a little reminder, we also archive all our shows on YouTube as well. So if you want to go back and see them all on there, uh, sometimes Twitch is a bit funny about stuff when it um, like mutes certain tracks or whatever, but uh, they're normally all up there on, on YouTube. So uh, yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> big up to uh, Kushi23. It's good to see you in, man. And uh, yeah, welcome, welcome back. Well, welcome back. But I mean, yeah, welcome to rediscovering us on Twitch. Um, so yeah, I was about to say a uh, big shout out to a man like uh, John Connor. Uh, he is doing a series of um, like podcasts uh, on his channel, which is John Connor on YouTube. Uh, go and check out. He uh, sent me a link to the NRG uh, one that he did in Taiwan, episode 10. I believe he just recorded episode uh, 13. Um, but yeah, there's like two hours of banging tracks now. We'll just give you guys a little preview of the kind of stuff you can expect. Should I... Uh, come on. Yeah, stuff like, this. He, like, John's going fully in with the green screen right now as well. Uh, so if you like this kind of stuff... <laughs> And some of this. Uh, I'm literally just skipping to any particular point. I don't have any. There we go. And stuff like this. Lots of techno. So uh, yeah, go and give us John Connor, J-O-N-C-O-N-N-O-R, John Connor, uh, who's come back from the future to suggest to loads of techno, so go and get on it, go and give him some love. All right, and it's reached that point in the show now where we go through our favorite streamers on Twitch. Uh, are you on Twitch yet, mate? 
Mm, I've got a Twitch account. Thinking about I don't it. use it a lot. Yeah. I don't use it enough, shall I say. Well, uh, if you want to get on it, then we'll quite happily uh, give you a promo on that okay. as well cool. and all that kind of stuff. In fact, I've been getting on um, since like lockdown happened and I like uh, was like not spending any time doing photo or video editing for a large amount of lockdown. Um, got back into mixing in a big way. Uh, so yeah, if you ever want to uh, do some mixed streams, either here or um, like cross promote all that kind of stuff, then I'm all down for that. Okay, man. Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Uh, right. We're gonna promote some of our favorite friends on Twitch with a little section I like to call. Here we go. Uh, Boombastic sounds events. <laughs> All right, so this week we're going to be following Jason Masood for your freestyle guitar rap needs. There's also Luxy Live, who is a fellow uh, DJ, Twitch streamer. She is sweet. You've also got 4 Ice 20 Music, who does all of the crazy uh, psychedelic mushrooms and Psytrons. You've got Mark One with all the guns and all the games. There is Spin Scott, who does uh, live sample of Jungle. He's an absolute bad man. There is also uh, Captain Flatcap for all your broken beats and flute needs. And last but not least, it is Oblivion Underground for all your hard industrial techno. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How do you oh, have the energy is. for this, bro? Oh, coffee, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. It's all the coffee and all the vibes. Oh, there's a second plane right now. Oh, I think yeah. it's that one. Oh, where have we got? Where's that? Um, that's Ankle Hub. Is it? <laughs> wait, wait, what? It's just a callback. Uh, oh, that's what that's what that is on there. Okay, right. Let's get off of all of those. Fantastic. As, uh, oh my gosh, uh, let's catch up with chat real quick because I think somebody was saying, uh, yeah, Atta Fry Wolf was saying, um, Powder, that's one of my, that's the track that I released on Das Booty. Yeah, so oh, sick. Thanks for, uh, so yeah, big ups for checking that one out. Fry yeah, Wolf. nice. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's time for everyone's favorite part of the show. Are you ready for this, mate? <laughs> yeah, man. Are you actually ready for. The part of the show everybody loves to hate oh, it is, of course, go. the unlucky dip. <laughs> oh, yes. Suddenly, the room has taken on a very sinister tone. <laughs> As we now have four tunes to choose from, um, each of them are covered up by links. Um, three of them are memes and mashups of the wrongest order, which makes you question, why do I keep coming back to this show every single week when I know he's gonna do it? He's gonna play a bunch of memes at us. Uh, one of them is the banging tune. It's up to you guys who are watching right now to find the banging tune. So, everyone in the chat right now, pick a number, one, two, three, or four, and we will choose your tune that is the most popular or the first. In fact, actually, as as we've had um, Max in for the first time, I will give you the honors, mate. Choose a number, one, two, oh three, or four. Oh my god. <laughs> um, three. You're going for three? Yeah. Is, is that your final answer? Uh, yeah. yeah <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's have a look. So Max can confirm that uh, all of these links are exactly identical. It is the impossible to tell. Yeah, it's just a bunch which. of, it's just a string of letters. Okay. So we're going to copy this in. Oh god. Right. Here we go. If I'm opening a new tab, posting it in. Oh my days. Here we go. Uh, Alright, so. Was there any specific reason why you went for number three? Uh, it was a it was a twenty five percent split, so just went exactly. with my gut. Went with my gut. <laughs> All right, so let's see if it was number three. Max Jones has chosen. What is it? <laughs> You've 
one. Okay, sweet. Uh, Roach in a bottle. Christina Aguilera versus Papa Roach. What could go wrong? I love both of these tunes, so. Here we go. Hear him. Cut my life into pieces. I reached my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing. Don't give a fuck if I cut my arm bleeding. Do you even That's care hard. if I die bleeding? Would it be wrong oh or did it be right? Never took my life tonight. Chances are that I might. Mutilation at a sight. And I got to play a suicide. Cause I'm losing my sight. Losing my mind. Wish somebody would tell me I'm fine. That's sick. Losing it's just a banger. <laughs> Third fight. It's just a banger. <laughs> Production on that Christine Aguilera tune is so good. <laughs> oh, as much as I hate to admit, you are right. <laughs> I never realized I was ready to live. To live was too late, and I was empty within. Hungry, feeding on chaos, and living in sin. Terror, spiral, where do I begin? It all started when I lost my mother. No love for myself, and no love for another. Searching to find a level upon a higher level. Finding nothing but questions and devils. Cause I'm losing my sight, losing my mind. Right, so next sick. person in this chat, choose one, two, or four. Oh, haven't we done it? It's another banger. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it finished now? Reborn Fist is like, oh dear god. Yeah. I know, it's great, isn't it? Shadow Blade is like, this is great. Yeah. This is great. This is, this is great. This is, this is great. Nothing's alright. Nothing is fine. You know what this actually reminds me of? Like the, the first event I went to was last Friday at um, fucking uh, the, the Loco Club. Yeah. And I, I was like, oh, I'm so glad to be back in the club. So, so glad to be back in the club. Listen to music nice and loud. What was the first tune that the DJ was playing when I walked into the main stage? Uh, I could do. Mr. Fucking Happy! Oh, really? Like, <laughs> I did not wait a year and a half to go up to Mr. <laughs> fucking Happy. Like, no. I'll get a drink. Oh, I'm man. going to the second room. I'm out. Yeah, that is rough. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Bro, this is just going, isn't it? This is just going. Yeah, it's a bit of a long song. It's the only thing I'll say about it. We get it. <laughs> well, let's get back into this. Jesus Christ. The second verse. Let's get out of this fucking hell. It's only, it's only three minutes long. It felt like that was a lot you, longer. That's, that's stone cold. It felt like that was a lot longer. Fucking hell. Right, let's get out of that. Oh, but we already lost two people because of that shit. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Oh, my God. Philistines. Days. Yeah, some people just can't appreciate good music, right? right. <laughs> We're men of culture here. Oh, well, one of us is. I don't, th I don't think I am. <laughs> I mean, I I've been pioneering this, this stupid segment for the last, like, year or in change. And, um, yeah, it's, it's I I I'm this deep in it now. I, just, I, just, I can't stop. I, I just have to keep going. We have to keep <laughs> playing this game <laughs> till my dying breath. <laughs> right, who's in, who's in the chat? If no one's chosen something, I'm just going to put run at random. Uh, where are we? Um, just not three again. Four. We've got four. Mr. Fcom went for four. Okay, cool. Yeah. Mr. Fcom, I'm gonna choose the tune for you, mate. Oh my god, like the scandalous behaviour in chat right now. Shadow Blade, Patrick now, and oh. since I went for number one. We got three ones. God. Okay, but I mean, Mr. Fcom did say four first, so yeah, I, I do feel it's like first versus um, the popular vote. Yeah. So I, I vote first. I okay. Mean, four. I, I did see the next person put it in the chat, so that he yeah yeah four, four. He, he's earned it. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna do that if I uh, Fcom. All right, so let's get them four in the chat, pasting it in. Okay, let's see what's behind door. 
Number four. It is. Oh. What is it? Oh, it's already it's tuned. Banger, it's it is Secular and Yano with a tune called Summon. Just like we are summoning the power to get out of this stupid segment <laughs> that is after this thing we finished loading. Let's get into it. Congratulations, Mr. Echo. You have won the bag and tube this week. Well played, sir. Well played. Woo. Let's go. I don't think ever anything will ever beat the uh, pa pa fucking Christian Aguilera mashup thing yeah. that we. Like, I, don't, I, I, don't, I literally don't even know how that I find went stuff in, now. Man. <laughs> Maybe we should do Tune a footwork SF jungle up. bootleg of it as well. Oh man, too much. <laughs> too much going on really in the title better. there, isn't it? Yeah. Like... <laughs> well, there you go. That's an idea for your next tune. Um, okay, cool. You've got to do it now. We've it first. Commissioned it on, on live on the app. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, and that was another uh, enrapturing edition of The Unlucky Dip. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. <laughs> now we're out of that uh, audio nightmare. Let's get in back into the, the uh, tune submissions, which is... Um, a tune by my good friend uh, TNT, who's come back in with uh, this tune called The Machine, aka Mr. FCOM. So I hope you're still in the chat, mate. Um, yeah, let's get on it. Oh, also, out to DJ Falafel. Yes, mate, how you doing? Good to see you. Who is saying a uh, heavy sound? And uh, Shadow Bay saying Nightmare. It was too short. Well,. There's always next week, mate. Don't worry. There's always plenty more time where we can go through all the memes and mashups. And uh, yeah, Reborn Fisk is saying that last tune was a nice release, by the way. Scan Ken Bass delivers some really good tunes. Yeah, 100%, mate. Alright, let's go.
what do you reckon this one, man? Oh, well, it's another genre I know nothing about. Yeah. Um, but I enjoyed it. Yeah, it's uh, pretty heavy, isn't it? Heavy's a word. <laughs> so you could use to describe it. Absolutely. Um, yeah. Uh, I I struggle with the tempo. I don't. I couldn't really get a groove into it. But I don't. Yeah. I don't know if that's really the the main aim. Um. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I think, like, with the industrial stuff as well, it's definitely more kind of like, you're just like, you're just in that sound. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, you're just yeah, kind yeah. of in it. <laughs> yeah, but I, I mean, again, the production sounded sick. Yeah, um, yeah. And yeah, I loved all the sounds that were going on in it. The kick was extremely aggressive, which I liked as well. Yeah, sweet. <laughs> well, there you go, uh, Mr. Fcom. Hope you enjoyed your play, man. Um, let's get on to the next one, which is by uh, Ezium and Dead Zodiac. This is a tune called Interference, which is out on Dromad. Uh, we feature this uh, label uh, quite heavily. They are on YouTube. Um, yeah, please do go and give them some love. They uh, host amazing artists every single week. So uh, yeah, go check it out. They didn't have like releases pretty much happening like almost like, every other day. So there's always a bunch of new music coming up on that. Uh, yeah, go and give them a follow. Reborn Fisk as well saying so big up mate thanks for the share no thank you man and uh, Mr Fcom as well saying thanks Polo no problems mate good tune <laughs> enjoyed it awesome stuff let's get back into this oh with that cheeky second drop drum and bass producers man they're on another level a lot of the time thank you sir. Cybernetics EP, Asylum and Dead Zodiac, like really, really good stuff. Could not recommend these guys enough. Yeah, that was wicked. Yeah. Big tune. All right. Uh, let's get straight into the next one because I know we're, we're pushing up against the time right now. Uh, next up is uh, DJ Falafel, who has recently just joined us in the chat as well. So this is perfect timing, mate. Uh, this is your tune called uh, Lucio. I think that's how you say that. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to getting into this. We're going to switch up gears a little bit right now and go into something a little bit different. So, um, yeah, enjoy.
this for sure. It's just like really happy and bouncy. Yeah. Reminds me of some of that, you know, like French style house music um, that was kind of popular around like mid 2000s, like um, mm. or early 2000s, like you know that Starlight Superman Lovers. Yeah. Like that kind of like really yeah, like whimsical sound with mm. the synths and stuff, but also yeah, just like yeah. really really heavy drums. I like that they're really punchy. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's giving me that vibe. It's like it's one of those like tunes you just want to hear out of the sound system and just like just give you like. Your rib cage good rattling. Be a really good bass. like, um, really good curveball. Yeah, know, yeah. Like, a moody house set. Oh, oh, it's got a little fade out. Oh and yeah. Then back in. All right. Nice. DJ Fluffle on that one. Yeah, that made my legs feel warm. Yeah. <laughs> sign of a good tune. There you go, yeah. Sign of approval from uh, Max is, uh, yeah, if you, got, if you get the legs warm, then you're doing something right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, is that a euphemism? No, I haven't just pissed myself. <laughs> <All right>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Right, uh, let's move into the next one, um, which is uh, by Myth. This is a tune called No Delay. This is out on Skank and Bass as well. Uh, Shadowbase is asking for DJ Flaffle SoundCloud, please. Or what, as I um, actually there forgot to mention. A, it's a bit, it's oh, there you go. Yes, it. it's all up in there. And if you want to find any other tune that we are playing tonight, there will be a full playlist with a link to everything that we have played, unless it's, 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 it's unless it's an exclusive. In which case, they'll just be pointed to the uh, the artist's main profile, so they they can release it when it's ready. But that's even more of a reason to go and follow all these amazing people. Let's get into it. So right now, we don't know further delay. Some of them, yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
argue with the base on that, really. Yeah, man. Solid. <laughs> really, really nice stuff there. Uh, let's just go straight into the next one because I know we're pushing up against the, the clock. And I, I don't want to keep um, Max for, for too long because I know you've already been here for quite, quite a bit of time. So I really <laughs> do appreciate been, it's been it. Time. Not, not yet, though. <laughs> Uh, let's get into the next one, which is by uh, Doodly Boxbush. This is a tune called Fair Cop Gov. Deadly Boxbush. Yeah. Fair Cop Gov. school cartoon to this as well. Yeah, the video is sick. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> Golden shower, that's called. Wow. Golden shower. I like the wow. Carol King vocals in that. Yeah, man. Uh, it's giving me an idea. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah. Uh, what do you reckon for? Um, do you have any uh, like thoughts for Doodly? Because I, I think he was saying that um, he's only, only recently been getting into uh, like production. Oh really? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it sounded good, man. Um, really nutty tune. I'd say. Um. Maybe, you know, just some basic production shit like uh, making sure you're kind of EQing out um, different elements so that they all sit nicely in the mix. They, yeah. It sounded a little bit muddy. Yeah. Um, but it kind of, that, that can also add to the kind of old school aesthetic of it. So, mm. you know, in moderation. Yeah. Um, I'll say you're on the right track for sure. Flash. There you go. All right, so uh, yeah, we come up to like the last tune for the night, which is uh, this was sent in by uh, Reborn Fisk using the uh, SR command earlier. So this is the last one we're going to play tonight, and then we're going to get out of here. Uh, but this was um, let's see, 
Madzu, Temjun, and Glimpse. I think that's how you say that. Uh, yeah, we're getting into some drama base. This is how we're going to finish the show tonight. So, uh, yeah, nice. last tune of the night. Let's walk in. Go! That was, yeah, 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 yeah. that was, that what? Again. What? That's outrageous. This is what we tune in for. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait. What have we got that? Oh, that got that. Aha. It's not like me, that did. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah. Like, <laughs> how are you like, throwing your mouth like that? Do <laughs> <laughs> This, mate. That's crazy. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. What a tune to end with. <laughs> oh my actual gosh. This tune is absolutely insane. Absolutely insane. Sound, it's a sound design on that one. It's just mental. That was insane. Yeah. Absolutely insane. What? 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 Very big. What? What? <laughs> yeah. Remo and Fitchy have officially Ooh. blown our minds, man. What the hell? Yeah, Co coming in with a, a tune selection like that. Jesus, dude. Mm. Whoa. Uh, we don't want more. We want uh, this. Okay. Here we go. There we go. Fight. Right. Oh, my days. Right, yeah, it is rapidly approaching 10 o'clock. Um, so, yeah, which just leaves me to say uh, thank you so much. Uh, Max, for coming in and hanging out today. It's been an absolute blast. Yeah, no um, problem. Thanks, man. Thanks yeah. for inviting me. Yeah, Have no problem time. at all. Yeah, anytime. Mate. And you're welcome to come back anytime you want, mate. Wicked, yeah. So, I'll be um, back. 
But yeah, that would be sweet. Um, uh, as a last little, last bit of a promo as well, I'll make sure that uh, if anyone happened to miss it earlier, these are all of Polo Lily's yes, links. Man. Pump them socials. Oh. Uh, where are you? Smash like. Uh, yes. Isn't like, subscribe. Um, follow. The streamers say. Click the bell. Um, just to do all the things. Just basically just smash your hands onto the keyboard repeatedly. <laughs> On all of the social sites where you find uh, hands Polo and Lily. heads, hands and heads and spoons. Yeah, <laughs> and he, he'll get the message. Yeah, he'll know what it's from. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, so I think we're about to uh, ready to finish off the stream tonight. Um, which just leaves me to say thank you to every single one of you that have stopped by. Uh, thank you for the follows, subscriptions, bits. Um, it's been a really, really awesome stream tonight, and um, yeah, I can't wait to do this again with you guys. Uh, streams are a little bit uh, sporadic from uh, this weekend going forward just because of um, uh, I'm going to be traveling abroad pretty soon and yeah, it's, it's, it's all a bit fucking nuts, <laughs> but I, I'm going to try and keep streams going as, as best as I can. Uh, if you aren't already, get on our Discord and uh, you'll be able to find out all the information I'll be posting up on, on there. Uh, if you're not already, go on to my YouTube where we will find the uh, the full archive version of the show and all the other ones before. Uh, and if you haven't already, actually go over and check out. I've been putting a lot of effort into uh, doing like the best of um, uh, like parts of our, our previous shows and uh, like funny moments and bits in uh, God was it the vod, vod section uh, of Twitch. Uh, last shout outs to uh, Frywolf saying Dubai. Yes, mate. It's gonna be it's gonna be nuts. Um, Patrick and Al saying thank you for the bangers. Big up Boom Bastic, big up Polo Lily with all the, the fiery love hearts. Big up yourself, Patrick. <laughs> and uh, Shadow Blaze saying it's been emotional. Yeah, it really has, mate. It's, it's holding been... back the tears over here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, holding back the ankles as well by the sounds yeah. of it. <laughs> uh, so for the raid, we're going to give my friend a Luminous Nova a raid. So uh, please do come and stay on and give her Boom Boom Bastic sounds a welcome. And yeah, I mean, um, with the last shout is there anything specifically that's happening? Uh, it's your next event is the 20th of August, right? Yeah, that's right. 20th of August at Cozy's. So if anybody wants to get sweaty in a basement with me, yeah. Yeah, Cozy's right, sweet. Bristol. So 20th of August, make sure you get down there if you can. Yeah. Um, otherwise, make sure you follow Polo Lily on all the socials to keep up to date with everything he's doing because you know you want to. Um, yeah, man. I love numbers. <laughs> I love exactly. Which, yeah, I love them going up as well. Uh, instant gratification all the time. That's what we're on the internet for. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's uh, what we're all about here. That's how I spend all my free time, just watching the numbers. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> just, just watching the ticket go up day by day. Thanks, Firewolf. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, let me get my outro on the go. Uh, do -do -do -do. Where are we? There we go. All right, guys, we're going to get out of that. Whoa, we're going to get out of here. Um, just leaves me to say thank you to uh, all of you guys out there that uh, are subscribed to this channel uh, on our Twitch. Uh, everyone that uh, supports us on um, my Patreon as well. Like, I really, really do appreciate it. And if you aren't on there already, why not go down to my Patreon and check it out. It's a pound for the sound. The full playlist for everything that we have played tonight will be immediately on there after the stream. Uh, for everyone else, it will be available at 7 p.m. tomorrow. Uh, I'll try and get a big stream if I can, uh, or two, um, but yeah, I, at the moment my schedule is kind of all out the window, so um, yeah, just make sure you're following and you'll more than likely see a pop when we go live. Uh, yeah, uh, once again, my massive thank you to uh, Max, aka Polo Lee, for coming in, and um, yeah, if you have any suggestions for future guests you want to see on the show, let me know down in my uh, DMs on my Discord or on the live music channel. channel. Papa Aguilera. <laughs> More Papa Aguilera. Yeah. I, I want to see the, the, the Footwork Jungle like, bootleg. Right. I, I, I'm challenging you right now to make that a thing. It's going to be like a 10 minute job. I'm just going to smack an arm out over it and done. Job done. All right, well, stay locked for all that and a whole lot more back on Boom Basic Sounds. Until the next time, guys. Love you all so much. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Later. See ya. Yeah.